Up for sale here is my 71 911T. I've owned them since about 94-95. Uh, it was previously owned by a friend of mine who bought it from his father. They had it in their family uh, from about 79. Previous to that, it had had several owners. I believe it was originally a Chicago area car. This car is a wonderful car. I absolutely hate to sell it, but I have neither the time, money, or skills required to give it a full restoration or to turn it into a race car, which is probably what it would really like to be. It has the 2.2 liter engine. Um, Solex carburetors are gone. It has a set of uh, Weber 40 IDAs, the K&N uh, air filter and housings. Uh, turbo tie rod ends in the steering. Suspension stock. It's got a set of aftermarket headers as the stock heat exchangers were shot. This is not a numbers matching car. Somewhere along the life of this car, prior to uh, my friend's family owning it, I think it had spun a main bearing or something, and it necessitated a set of uh, replacement cases. It had been rebuilt, and um, that probably would have been about 79 or 80 when my friend's family had bought the car. Since then, the only thing that's been done have been uh, carburetor rebuilds. I had the transmission rebuilt at Bob White Automotive in uh, Tampa. Shifts okay. I've never driven another one of the old uh, 911, 901 style of transmissions to know how good or bad they should be. This car is, uh, has been extremely reliable for me. I think I broke a clutch cable once. I think it wouldn't start once because I had the alternator belt, generator belt too loose. Other than that, it's been a wonderful car. I can get in it any time and drive it. All I ever do is leave it on the battery tender. But he has his issues. Somewhere along the line, these rear quarters got very, very rusty. And they were patched or panels cut out and replaced and leaded in. That was well prior to me owning the car. At this point, the best move would be to get new rear quarters and have them welded on. Again, I just don't have the skills. It's on both sides. It's pretty bad. Of course, you could get some fiberglass fenders and just turn them into a race car. He'd probably really, really like that. But I don't have the ability to do that either. Um, 71's had a pretty, uh, most of the undercarriage was galvanized, and it's not bad. The brakes are the, uh, aluminum front calipers, and the steel rears. The Fuchs are 14-inch, 5 and a half. They could be made better looking also. It needs new window seals. I've been messing around with this door on and off for years, mostly off. I have the panels. I just haven't put them back on. Actually, everything works again. I just a friend of mine gave me a set of panels out of his 911 SC because I don't have the uh, the hinged lower pockets, and I was going to put those on. Just haven't gotten around to it. Momo GT steering wheel. Interior is not bad, all things considered. I put a, you know, four or five hundred dollar carpet set in it. Did the job just fine. Original low back seats need to be redone. Put the rear seat material in. It's never been, they've actually never been sat in. Car leaks around the window seals. It stays in a garage. Prior to that, it was in a carport. 
rear windows, they pop out like they're supposed to. Hardware can be redone. Again, just a simple little 2.2 flat six stock ignition, fuel pressure regulator there, fuel filter. The original fuel tank I had coated and sealed it with something from a company called Worth many years ago. I've never had a problem since. I actually have a uh, fuel filter front and rear, but they've been clean forever. Uh, I did put the pressure uh, fed cam chain tensioner kit on. Never had a problem with that either. Uh, I think I put the Carrera lower valve covers on. I don't remember now. It's been a while. I've had this car almost 20 years. Don't know if it shows up in the video. Yeah, maybe here. Years and years and years ago, my friend was playing, his brother was playing basketball, and basketball hit the glass window on the garage door, and the window smashed down on the hood. That was all redone, obviously not very well. And the interior here, they always look good when you have the carpet set in them. Here's some brand new window seals I bought many years ago, thinking that I would get around to doing the restoration. I don't even know if they're, they would be considered good today. Old belt I just kept for a spare. Let's see. And all the stock uh, wiring stuff. I think that relay was for a set of air horns at one time. I've gone away from the two uh, batteries. They were going to be a bear to find. And I have the small Odyssey battery up here in the uh, smuggler's nook, whatever you want to call it. Blast from the past. Here's a... What is this? A Uniroyal spare tire. I don't think that ever needs to see the road. Well, there you have it. Like I said, I hate to sell this car, but... You might see a 944 in the background. I bought a car to go do track days with. Because I just... It's cheaper to buy that car than... I don't know, maybe the money would have been about the same. All I know is I don't have the skills. So, somebody give this car a good home. It deserves it. Thanks for looking.